Ladies and gentlemen, I am your host, Michael Manning, and welcome back to oh, <laughs> twitch.tv slash Baron Esports. I am your host, Michael Manning. Tonight we are here for another exciting game of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Tonight we have for you a exciting match, a rematch actually from a last semester, last ECAC season. We have Penn State Baron. Team one, our recurring champions, <laughs> up against St. Francis University, who, again, um, sorry, one sec, folks. Boop, 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 there we go. Um, but, This is a rematch. St. Fred's University went up against Baron last semester. Baron did manage to close out there. But things have changed. Lineups have changed. They have for Baron, and they very likely have for St. Francis as well. This game is, is anything but cut and dry. Doing a quick button check here. Make sure everything's okay. Make sure the connection is stable. Make sure everybody is ready to go. Time, folks. Um, thanks to that, Baron is expecting a couple characters. Remember, remember, you can't trust the picks in um button checks. They are in, they are entirely non-committal. So last uh, last time we saw a Baron's been very consistent with their picks, slowly adding some extra characters on top of their mains. Um, you're always gonna expect Pac-Man. You're gonna see, probably see a Ganondorf. You have Peach now with um Goldman, Tristan. But, Baron has a lineup they're expecting. Uh, they're expecting a Wii Fit, a Banjo, um, and potentially... I'll make sure my is right. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Banjo, Wii Fit, a Wii Fit Trainer, and a Min Min. I don't, I don't remember, I remember the Wii Fit, but I don't remember Min Min, I'll be honest, so we'll have to see. Like, we're opening with the Pac Man once again, as expected by Baird. Testing the waters a bit. Waiting on St. Francis. Looks like we're having a minor connection issue. I'll be right back, folks. I will get this sorted ASAP, and we will be right back. One second. Are you all fixed? We are right back to it. Looks like that prediction was correct. Let's say Baron Noah starting a Pac-Man up against State Fancy University opening up once again with this Wii Fit. Both players have had plenty of time to get better, to improve, to adapt and learn these matchups better. 
Wow, nice catch by We Fit. Doing, trying to do a good job meeting. Ooh, meeting Noah's projectile game. Oh my gosh, the combined hit from the F Smash and the Fire Drip is almost enough to close out the stock. Ooh, nice block on the bell. Oh, nice dodges. Has that deep breath. A lot of extra damage coming out if We Fit could survive. Ooh, and there's the there's off. She does have a good chunk of rage built up, though. There's the full sun charge. All the different yoga poses from We Fit throw me off so hard. Going flying 130% here. And. Deep breathing, plenty of damage. Oh, that Hydra connects. Still not enough to kill, though. If it is holding on. Reflects the apple with the sun salute. Nice back air. 150%. Keep it flat. Yeah. Keep it simple as that apple wants to just secure this. Is he dropped for the reset? Wow, that ball went flying. Nice parry. Oh, he has a key online. And there it is! First stock of the night is down. If it doesn't have to worry about the high percent anymore, they're gonna play a bit more aggressive. Nice stuff. 49% on Wii Fit already. 100%! On Pac-Man almost dies right then and there 122 in and the deep breathing Fantastic DI he's holding on by a thread. He can't take much more of those And with all that rage, all that damage, that's another stock gone. I bet still holding on 155. Nice grab. Let throw be enough for the deep breathing. Just might not quite. It's going high. Getting red. Finally, there goes Pac Man's first stock. Nice. Extra damage that salutes some percent. pretty even, but Pac Man is still a full stock ahead. Wow, remarkably even percent here. 70 on both sides. Oh, that up smash with the deep breathing. It's like that. Stocks are tied. Nice parry by Pac-Man. Ooh, reads the roll, but there's no punish. If that key doesn't connect, they pull up their charges up. And with that key, we'll take the first game. Going into the next member of St. Francis University with only one stock. It's going to be dangerous. But we've seen new Noah do more with less.
Okay, sorry for the folk. You know, the second round. One stock left. Noah moves into second member of Save France University on Ness. Okay, here we go. Nice combo with the apple there, 45% already. Remember, Ness is a fairly light character, though he does serious damage. Well, 1pk fire launches the hydrant, good to know. And remember, that bat does reflect. Trades up on Synth Smash. Miss up to 90 here. Ooh. No has the bell ready. No grab. Percent on both sides. Oh, that was dangerous! The up air without losing a stock, and that's knocks Noah out of the running, evening it back up for St. Francis. Okay, next member coming out. Peter on Dark Pit. I've seen some really, really nice stuff from his Dark Pit. Those are some of those snipes. He's got to be careful. I do believe that um, Dark Pit's arrows count as energy for Ness's absorption. So he's got to have to be a little careful. Hits. Ness trying to space that PK Thunder. If Peter can't hit the ground fast enough to punish. Nice damage to that PK Thunder throw. The hop over the up smash. 
Oh my gosh, that was dangerous. The read of the roll into PK fired. Poor throw. Nice extra damage. Oh no, that electroshock. Not much of a punish, but still. Oh, there's the the clash. And there's the first stock. This is down. We're into the down throw. Ooh. Let me, oh yeah, there's the padded nest back throw. Kids pulled around two stocks. Hop over the peak of fire, but immediate punish. Serious damage, 100% on Ness. Okay, looks like Dark Arrow either didn't connect or doesn't count. Oh, the reed blocks the get up attack, and he's out of there. Down to a final stock. Dude, trying to get those runoff confirms. Stets both playing neutral very patiently. Oh, there's the grab into the down throw. Nice dodge away from the forward air or the up air. And the up air will take it. You no, know, Peter knocks out the second member of. Looks like I'm the last man standing. <laughs> takes out the second member of St. Francis University. On to the final member of St. Francis for this first round.
St. Francis gauging their options, figuring what might go best into this, and also picking map. Luigi as the final pick by St. Francis. stuff by Luigi trying to take this stock nice and early if, if Peter could get even one he'll put Baron in a very nice spot ooh nice stuff by Luigi ooh there's the grab punish into the back air serious damage 115% oh the electro shock doesn't reach Luigi does that another up smash and that close it out Close out, Peter. So it's, we're up to 2v2 now. Or 1v1 now. for the map pick. Because you might be going to PS2. Yeah, it looks like <laughs> we want to go to PS2 at least.
still waiting. Peach is the final member of Baron. So, here we go. Peach versus Luigi. On Town and City. I still have Luigi 160% on Peach here. She's got to find a footing, but Luigi, so many ways to get in. Oh my gosh, the weight on that back air. Dash deck already percents almost evened up. Fighting for an in here. Okay, so that turn Oh, Luigi barely managed to make it back up. The straight toss up reclaims it. Stops the side B. Luigi managed to catch the turn up. Nice spacing there, but can't land the punish on that dash attack. And there it is, finally. 1-1. One, one. Or 2-2. Two, two. Sorry. I'm... Pfft. Wow, right out the gate. And with that sweet spot up you wow. Okay, with that, St. Francis end up ends up taking the first game We're back to the top here, and Baron has to consider who they want to send out first. You're inside, you need to consider really, like, who's the major threat when it comes to St. Francis? I'd argue the Luigi after that little performance. So you might want to save Noah for that Luigi.
Okay, once again, opening with no on Pac Man. No, we're doing a good job. Trying to set the pace here. Managed to reclaim that belt as well. Doesn't have to keep nice block by Ness. With a read on that unshield. Why <laughs> the up tilt sets it at such an awkward angle? Wow! Nice stuff with the item juggles there by Noah. Taking this out, only taking 26% of his own. Gets back up thanks to the Galaga. Of that PK fire, getting rid of the hydrant. No, it's just totally forcing him out of position. Oh, the air dodge on the, the non-directional air dodge on that hydrant knockback. No fear. Send some hydras and knock Pac Man out of the sky with that PK spark, but can't quite. The bell flies to the hydrant 138% on Ness. Oh, jumps right to the hydrant and goes so high. Knows first stock, but Ness is second. Nice parry, but don't forget it's a multi hit. With that up smash, there goes Ness. And there goes, in the second round, the first member of St. Francis. Though moving into the second member with two stocks. Last time he couldn't get a lead for his team. If he can get anything here, Baron will be in a very... Well, they're already in a very, very nice spot. But any little extra credit he can get here by knocking out stocks is going to be fantastic. So we're discussing where the next map's gonna be.
taking a sec, just waiting for the next map selection to be locked in. Okay, we fit the second member of St. Francis up against. We get to know on Pac-Man, still the first member of Baron. Still has two stocks. Getting even one here will be a huge boon for Baron and do a fantastic job of keeping their lead. Both playing very squirrely. Nice catch on the um his catch on the key. Turn it around and do some serious damage to Pac-Man. Hundred sixty one, one hundred sixty three on Pac-Man, one hundred and one on Wii Fit. Both in explosive damage ranges here. He's still holding on though. Hundred seventy four. There goes Pac Man's second stock. His favorite towards being more aggressive. You only have one life left, you gotta make some use of it. And 
And there it goes. First stock on Wii Fit. Nice damage on Bullseye. Wow, at 54%. That deep breath up smash killed. No, I managed to take out Wii Fit's first stock. Couldn't get much else. Remember the team getting picked up. Choose your fighter. You too. So we're going in with Peach. Okay. He's gonna do everything she can to knock out We Fit.
Sets up both sides, 17 and 16. And wow, with some great, okay. Not only some great damage, he has a stitch. That's, oh, there it goes. <laughs> that was some serious damage if we could have connected it. Jumping into the float back air. 59% here. We fit managed to land the grab. That F smash. Here goes Peach for stock. Nice stall with Salute the Sun there, 100%. Wow, and there goes Peach's second stock. 101%. And that forward air will take it. Doing some great, uh, Weefa did a great job evening that up, but Peach manages to close it out with one stock left. We're waiting for the next map to be chosen. Sorry, folks.
He's gonna give him first two stocks. We're seeing a rematch here. Remember though, Peach only the second member of Baron. All he's gotta do is as much damage as possible. Nice. Beta, uh, that, if that counter kick, that would have been very interesting. Luigi has the Mr. Saturn, but you gotta be careful. Took, I know it took a lot of self control to not shield that, and it's a good thing because that could have just been death. Beasting even one stock here. He's holding on. Wait a minute. He's not dead yet. Oh. There's the back throw. And Peach managed to take a stock, putting Baron in a very, very nice position. Still fighting though, not dead yet. Oh my gosh, the suction cup connects. And that back throw will take it. Okay, Luigi, two stocks left, is going to move into the final member of Bed State Baron. If he wins here, St. Francis, take the night. We're going to be going in with Incineroar. Interesting. Folks, just waiting for the map to be selected. Things to be set up for potentially the final round.
Here we go. Baron finishing off with Incineroar here in this final round. Potentially final round of the night. Incin's gonna have to make it through two stocks. If he can, we go back to the third round and reset. Only take a 22% mage to knock out Incense first stock. And with a very nice carry down. There it goes. Ooh, there's the counter. Makes it for Minson can do a lot of damage. I should by Luigi. Ends up to 133%. Okay, potentially final stock of the night. Incident's got to put in some work here. He's, if he close out this stock, Baron's still in the running, but got to play careful. Another fantastic follow-up grab by Luigi. Just doing damage to Incident all along the stage, carrying him to the edge. There's back air. The back throw. Both at very explosive percents here. Next big hit might take it. Luigi you doing a great job controlling the space. Into the dash tech, Incense gotta find his way close. Bring it cautious. Luigi using that uh that suction cup is a fantastic Area denial to Oh no, the tailbeam doesn't connect. Wow, the recovery into the side beam. I would have lost it if that was a misfire. Nice back air by Ensign. Ooh, very dangerous. Oh, the dash attack! Ensign's holding on. 150%. Come on, it's a very awkward recovery, but he managed to make it. No punish by Luigi. Into the forward tilt! Oh my god! That was so tense. That was so close. But Penn State Barrett's final member on Insin manages to hold the line, evening the game up 1 1. We're going to a grand final series here, folks. Once again, back to the top. Three stocks on everybody, three members on both sides.
So we'll be opening with Incineroar on Baron's side. Leaning towards AD. Or leaning towards FD. Town and city, actually. Actually, okay, yeah, sorry. Pac-Man versus Banjo here. Reset bracket. <laughs> Misses me the Banjo's a move that's just like an actual grenade. There's the bell. The wing does not connect. That bell does, though. A real follow-up, though. goes Banjo's first stock. Here's pack bits first. 40% on banjo. Two to two. <laughs> Pac Man forward smashes that grenade and it just literally blows up in his face. Managed to recover your the power pellet into the trampoline. He's still up. Not gonna join Banjo with one side left. He still has two.
Vehicle projectiles on both sides flying wide. Oh my gosh! Back me runs back into the hydrant. He's got the key live. Oh, that Wonder Wing almost takes pac second stock. He has a follow-up with the, uh... Exhaust there, no punish. Oh, never mind, reads that jump up. Hits him with the back air, nice stuff. 114% on Pac-Man now. Setting up for the kill here. Oh, jumps right past that bomb. Oh no, recovers fast enough. Reed gets it with the bell. Back air. Oh wow, it was some funky DI. That will close out the first member of St. Francis. Darren is up two stocks here, moving into the second member. Remember, it's the final game. It all comes down to this. It's one that really matters. Eight stocks to six. Wow. <laughs> St. Francis was ready to hop back in there. Just guessing on what the next map will be. of two stocks you've seen him do a lot more with a lot less so I'm I'm, I'm excited the real question is who is st. Francis gonna tap in maybe a new person maybe we'll see the um Luigi hopping in a bit earlier than usual though he seems to primarily be primarily act at say as st. Francis's anchor their final weapon We fit. Wow. Um, there goes We Fit's first stock. That's a very nice, just like that. Um, Doctor even. Luke does take out. Oh, nice hop over the key. Yeah. Tries to be a little, ooh, nice forward air carries into the up throw. No, shifting over to some very nice aggression. Launch that hydrant right back. Ooh, there's the deep breath. That's a lot of power for Weep, but we've seen just how much extra kill extra kill power that gives her oh my gosh the raids no he's insane Into the down air not giving her a moment to breathe managed to recover but deep breathing's gone and after the first cast oh another f smash will take it oh lag city wow Hey, who's kicking the router? <laughs> oh my gosh. That is that is not on our end, ladies and gentlemen. That is that is the game. Oh my gosh. Wow, we're, we're still this connection is a trooper. We are still hanging on though. 30% of very nice combos. The read and the extra galligatoss. Just like that, it was in the lead with the percent. It's like he's in the lead with stocks. There's the bell. Nice little hit there. Ooh, goes wide. No, it's to get. I mean, it's just drop it. Deep breathing's down. He can play a bit more aggressive now. 
Oh, the read! A little too far forward! Jab combo, no! He's buried again, but not enough! Just a deep breath. So much more damage, so much extra knockback. He goes wide. They're doing great job space with these forward airs. As the bell set up. Oh, there's another rear that forward smash. Oh my gosh, the Z drop on the orange kept it bouncing enough to connect. The apple! Oh my gosh. So much item knowledge. This projectile knowledge on pac side is truly insane. The back throw! Wow! Baron's first member, Noah. Team captain, or, uh, well, game captain for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Managed to make it through the second member of St. Francis University without losing a single stock. Baron's, Baron, we are looking at a, a life difference of 8 to 3 here. Moving in to the potentially final match of the night. The final member of St. Francis is stepping up, Luigi. He's got three lives to work with and three opponents to chunk through. He has his work cut out for him. But we've seen him make some insane plays already. He knows how to play his <laughs> He knows how to play his character. Let's see if it's gonna be enough. As they discuss the map, I'm going to take a step away. I'll be right back, folks. Moving into the, potentially the final match between Penn State Baron and St. Francis right here on Twitch.tv slash Baron Esports. We will be right back.
We are back, folks, and potentially the final match of the night. Penn, Penn State Baron, Pac-Man. Up against St. Francis' final member, their last defender on Luigi. Oh, the Galaga connects, but down B gets him out of it. <laughs> forward tilts the, uh, or forward smashes the, um, Hydrant eats over Pac-Man. Nice grab. Nice grab. Two absolute character specialists here. That was almost on beat with the song. What? Just blocking the melon. Ooh, get up attack. Pac-Man has bell ready. Wow. You know the funky part about uh, using trampoline on the hydrant like that is that the hydrant's hitbox was active that entire time. Bell connects. No real, no follow up though. Oh my gosh! She parried the key. That was a little terrifying. Clinks with the orange. Side piece back on. Eats that barely charged down smash. And no recovery tools left. You couldn't touch the ground. There goes Luigi's first stock. No, already in a hundred percent. Oh my gosh! Hitting the hydrant extended the hitbox, kept it active on that back air from Luigi. Ooh, Galaga connects. It's a nice extra chunk of damage. Eighty-three percent on Luigi's second stock. Manchester Recover doesn't want to risk being off stage yet again. Oh no! Hit the final hit of the trampoline, put him in a helpless spot, he crumbled. Bell connects. Pac-Man managed to cover it. The Z drop! But he miss misses the forward smash, doesn't matter. Run him down, there's the back throw, just like that. Both members on their final stocks. Pac-Man only 20% behind. Throws out the grab again. Immediate down by Luigi. Get off me. Only a 30% deficit here. Dash tech connects. Pac-Man might be. Might have the momentum, but Luigi does so much burst. All he needs really is a moment. Pac-Man's got to stay in control. Just grab into the down B. And that's going to be enough. Baron's first member, Pac-Man, is finally gone. Now, it's one life to six. Luigi has to grind through two full members of Baron. Like I said, he has his work cut out for him. Gotta wait for the stage to be selected. Take a member of Baron to moving in on Insid.
Okay. All Ensign has to do is take one stock. He needs to kill Luigi once. And Penn State Baron close out the night. Can't be caught in Luigi's Three, vortex. Two, one, go. Okay, can we see a misfire? I, I want to see a misfire. Hey, there it is. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Immediately, the sucks are cut. It's four throw. Ooh, and a down throw. Nice spacing by Instant with these forward airs. Oh, wow. Very nice patience on that. Oh, recovery by Luigi into the grab. Nice. She's remarkably even. Instant has a bit of a lead. Nice grab into the back throw. Oh no! The misfire connects no tech from Incineroar. Losing his first stock. Already 116% on Luigi though. We just gonna have to play this so carefully. Oh, a bit of a lag spike. Oh no, here comes the Luigi combo. Look at that damage. Just from that interaction, 74%. Down tilt in the up air. 140% Luigi. Oh, there's the side B. No sweet spot on the side B though. The clothesline definitely would have taken that. Don't want to give this, you don't want to give Luigi another shot here. There's the grab, there's the suplex. And Ped State Barrett, after a very rough first round and a very close second one, managed to take the night 2-1 over St. Francis University in a set of incredibly competitive, very exciting games. So folks, thank you so much for tuning in tonight. I've been your host, Michael Manning, right here. If you want to make sure you catch every stream that Ped State Barrett Esports puts up. You can follow us right here on twitch.tv slash Baron Esports so that you never miss a stream. You'll always be notified. If you do miss one, you can follow us on youtube.com slash Baron Esports where all of our streams will be uploaded for um, permanent storage. You can follow us on Twitter and Instagram, also at Baron Esports on both. So uh, to keep updated with any kind of schedule changes or anything that may shift. And if you want to hear more from me, you can find me on rss.com slash podcast slash Nerdhaven. Um, to hear more of me talk about games I love, the things I enjoy, and um, why I think spending some time and making sure you're happy is important. But yeah, I, I was going to say, these are just casual games. This is spirit me for a sec. But folks, thank you so much for tuning in. Once again, I've been your host, Michael Manning. This has been the Pet Saber Sports Channel. Please be safe, be good to each other, and have a fantastic night.